Good morning. It was a splendid trading session for the Indian equity markets today as bulls marched ahead for the second consecutive day. The BSE Sensex surged by almost 300 points while the NSE Nifty rallied by 90 points to close above 17,600 and 5,350 respectively. The Indian stock indices flared up despite overnight losses in US markets and weakness across most of the Asian markets today. Today's upswing was led by short covering in large cap shares while the stocks in broader markets saw some long build up. Stocks advanced across sector today. The Capital Goods Index and the Realty Index on the BSC were the top gainers, up by approximately 3.5% each. The Banking Index was up by 2.4% and the Metal Index was up by 1.8%. Power, Tech, Metal, IT, Auto, PSU and Pharma indices climbed between 1-2%. to Consumer Durable, FMCG and Oil and Gas indices were up by less than 1% underperforming the broader market. Even the BSE Mid Cap Index and the BSE Small Cap Index were up by 1.9% and 1.2% respectively. Interestingly, the India VIX on the NSE plummeted by 4.3%. Notable gainers on the Sensex and Nifty were LNT, DLF, Tata Steel, TCS, ICICI Bank, Bharti Airtel, Bale, and Bajaj Auto. Among the top losers on both the indices were Hindalco, ONGC, ITC, Sun Pharma, and Hero Motor Corp. The total turnover of the Indian market today was 1.78 trillion. The centre has managed to survive the numbers game in Parliament with a little help from regional parties, but the roadblocks lay ahead. The government's resolve will be tested when it decides to push hard policy decisions like a fuel price rate hike. It is also under pressure to roll back the proposed railway fare hike. Status quo seems to be UPA 2's mantra for stability, but the persistent struggle on policy making doesn't bode well for the economy. The markets will continue to be jittery unless the government manages to spring a pleasant surprise. The good thing about today's session is that advance has come despite weak global backdrop. Most Asian markets ended lower though stock indices in China, Taiwan and Hong Kong managed to recover from sessions low. Asian equity benchmarks fell today as worries over slowdown in China pressured resource stock. The MSCI Asia Pacific Index led by 0.7% today. European stocks rose for the first time in three days while commodities also gained. The stock's Europe 600 index was last trading flat, but markets in Germany, UK and France were up marginally. US stock market futures were pointing to a higher start on Wall Street. Oil rebounded from the biggest decline in three months after an industry-funded report showed that crude stockpiles fell in the US. Oil prices slid yesterday as Saudi Arabia said that it may boost supplies. Oil futures traded in New York gained as much as 0.7% today after declining by 2.3% yesterday. Shares of Tech Mahindra and Satyam Computer are up for the second day running after the two companies formally announced a merger. The company said that 8.5 shares of Satyam will be given to Tech Mahindra shareholders for every share held by them. Thank you. Wish you have a great evening ahead.